Well, we do have shocking new details out of Lakewood, where Naomi Elkins is charged with drowning her two young daughters. News 12 New Jersey's Amanda Lee is here with more and a warning this evening. These new details are extremely graphic. Today we received the court documents explaining Tuesday night's tragic details and a statement from the Elkins family attorney explaining her mental state. We also learned that Elkins was an employee at the daycare attended by her toddlers. According to the affidavit, Elkins told detectives she began having concerning thoughts on Monday and spent the night praying. The next day, she went to work at Giggles Daycare in Lakewood, bringing her kids as she always does. Upon returning home, Elkins told police she believed she needed to kill the children for religious purposes. Did you hear and understand the video that was played for everyone earlier today? Yeah. In the affidavit, Elkins admitted to drowning both her daughters in bathtubs after stabbing one of them, telling police she realized she had done something wrong afterward and contacted medical services. Authorities say the one and three year old were found unresponsive and unclothed, one daughter suffering stab wounds in the stomach and back. The owner of the residence says it was rented out to Elkins and her husband, who was on a business trip at the time. Elkins is facing murder charges and the unlawful possession of a weapon in both deaths. The Elkins family attorney says the 27 year old has a well documented history of severe mental illness, which has absolutely played a major role in these devastating events. He says, quote, while we acknowledge the seriousness of the charges that she is facing and respect same, we also believe that it's important to recognize the incredible complexities presented by mental health challenges. Naomi Elkins will appear in court again on Monday for a detention hearing. Reporting in studio, Amanda Lee, News 12 New Jersey.